Good day, Sir Francisco D. Registrado. Good day, classmates. At this moment, I will be reporting all about materials, tools, and equipments in drawing. But uh, before anything else, let me give this opportunity to introduce myself. By the way, my name is Albert P. Berwala, second year BTLED 2A. Okay, let's proceed. Let's come now to my introduction. Drafting, also called engineering drawing, graphical representation of structures, machines, and their components, parts that communicate the engineering intent of a technical design to the craftsman or worker who makes the product. So, um, at this moment, um, as uh, your first reporter, entitled Material, Materials, Tools, Equipments in, in Drawing, uh, let me um, tackle about crafting. So, um, I've read that crafting is also called engineering drawing, uh, meaning graphical representation of structures, machines, and their component parts that communicate the engineering intent of technical design to the craftsman or worker who makes the product. So, uh, we may confuse of why we are uh, tackling it or studying about um, drafting or uh, civil technology that uh, hindi naman tayo mga uh, engineering. So, ang iba sa atin ay hindi naman talaga um, uh, fashion, mag-drawing, or hindi natin alam kung paano gawin ang drawing, kagaya ko. But then, we are here to talk about all about uh, materials, tools, equipments in drawing as a part of the topic in uh, under the AS1 Introduction to Industrial Arts. Most of us started drawing when we were young. Uh, kadalasan, karamihan, marami sa atin na um, nagsasanay na mag, uh, mag-drawing since bata pa tayo. Uh, nagiging hilig na natin ito hanggang sa uh, ang iba sa atin ay nang tumanda na ay talagang naging hilig na itong pag to drawing. Back then, materials and tools were not that important to us. Siyempre, bata pa tayo, hindi pa natin masyadong uh, uh, ina-appreciate kung anong klaseng uh, materials, tools, or equipment yung ginagamit natin. Ang mahalaga ay mayroon tayo. Gusto lang natin gawin kasi kapag hindi natin iba na hindi na ibigay ng magulang yung um, materials na yon tools or equipment na yon ay umiiyak tayo kasi bata pa nga tayo. Perhaps, they were not even considered. A standard pencil on some notebook paper would often do the trick. But as we grow, develop as artists, the materials and tools that we choose became more important. So, habang nag, uh, we reach the maturity stage, we will able to uh, appreciate what uh, material is suitable and advisable for us. So, um, alam na natin kung alin yung mas maganda at mas advisable, suitable na mas uh, papasok sa taste natin sa standard natin na materials and tools tools na gusto nating gamitin. The connection between daily art, materials, and quality artwork becomes noticeable along the way, and it's no wonder that emerging artists des decide to have the very best material possible. Mas napapansin na sa atin na um, yung quality uh, art, materials, and the quality artwork uh, nagsisimula yung quality doon mismo sa uh, materials, tools na ginagamit natin upang uh, maging uh, 
uh, quality din yung output or the quality of the artwork that uh, we need to have or uh, we are planning to create. Understood? If you are starting to get serious about your artwork, no matter what aids you, you may also be starting to get serious about the materials that you use. So, at different states, at different age, um, uh, the habit, uh, uh, the desire that we want to do that is the particular thing, example, uh, we like this thing, uh, we want this thing, I want this thing, so gagawin mo yun, kasi nga, uh, gusto mo. If you are starting to get serious about your artwork, no matter age, kahit anong edad, so magsisimula ka dun hanggang sa each level ay talagang uh, mag-progress ka. Understood? Then, um, uh, let's go uh, in the common drafting tools and uh, materials and equipments here I've listed uh, many uh, drafting or drawing tools and materials and equipments here but before we proceed let me define the following terms what is material material is something used in doing a particular activity so ito yung um, um, something na ginagamit natin uh, para maisagawa yung uh, pagdodrawing natin or uh, drafting. Then, tool. What is a tool? A tool is a hand-held device that aids in accomplishing a task. Ito naman, ginagamit naman natin itong tool para matapos or ma-accomplish yung isang uh, particular na uh, task. Using the material, ito, um, para maging successful, yung um, uh, process, so, ginagamitin natin itong tool sa material upang um, maging successful or ma ma maging maganda yung output or masterpiece na gusto nating uh, palabasin. Understood? Next, what is equipment? Equipment is the supplies or tools needed for a special purpose. Itong equipments na ito ay ginagamit natin for a special purpose. So, dito, malalaman natin yung mga common drafting or drawing tools and materials and equipments. So, ma malalaman din po natin ang uh, uh, during the process of my report, Kung ano ba itong equipment na ito. Itong equipment ay ang supplies or tools na uh, needed na ginagamit for a special purpose. First on the list, the materials. Material I've listed here first is the quality drawing pencils. Well, start off with the most obvious essential, quality drawing pencils. When it comes to drawing pencils, each artist will find a brand that they connect with. Siyempre, if you are comfortable to use it, gusto mo tong uh, gamitin. Kung ano yung gusto mong gamitin na brand, yun yung masusunod. Kasi, um, makapagsisimula ka lang ng isang gawain kung yung mismong gagamitin mo na uh, tool ay talagang uh, gusto mo. There's no way to know which brand will become your favorite until you try a few. Uh, at a younger age, we will not able to appreciate what the brand is until uh, now that we are uh, getting older, we appreciate already the brand, which we already um, use it in the previous um, uh, drawing or drafting experience. Am I right? Okay. 
Uh, um, uh, me, I'm share with with you. Um, I use pencil, uh, the broad Mongol one and two. But um, it's depend upon on you if what you use. But for me, I prefer to use the Mongol one and Mongol two. Next, drawing pencil set. Pencil sets usually come packaged in nice tins can be great because they often include the full spectrum of graphite grades. Many sets include pencils with harder graphite 9H, true softer graphite or the 6B. Harder graphite makes lighter marks and keeps a sharp tip longer while softer graphite makes a darker mark but needs constant resharpening. These sets give the artist the ability to work with many different values and varieties of mark. Learn more about the different grades of profit here. So, uh, drawing pencil set, um, uh, I don't remember what the brands of the pencil I already used, but uh, among them, I uh, honestly uh, use the brand uh, Mongol 2, preferably. Then, sketchbooks. A uh, sketchbook is one of the most important things an artist can have. Simply, if you, uh, if, uh, you love, if your fashion is drawing, uh, um, I'm really sure that you have this sketchbook. I should point out that I'm referring to an active sketchbook, one that receives attention on a daily basis. If you have this uh, sketchbook, you probably will draw what you are thinking. Uh, because uh, I believe that uh, what you experience, what you have uh, in your mind, Personally, so that's all uh, what you you draw or sketch uh, on your sketch pad. Anyone can own a book with the blank pages of drawing paper. Yes, it's it is really true that uh, any one of us can own to have this uh, property uh, book where we, wherein we. Uh, uh, tend to write, to draw whatever we want, so whatever purpose we have. But the one that actively gets drawn in on a daily basis is one of the value. Kung ano yung talagang um, tumatak o uh, nagbigay sa atin ng impact, so yun yung gagamitin natin. Kasi uh, dun, uh, dun yung nasusuffice yung needs natin. Talagang maganda. Next, variety of erasers. Erasers are for mistakes, right? Siyempre, itong erasers, kapag nagkamali tayo, halimbawa, nag, nag-draw tayo uh, during uh, sketching, drafting, or drawing, so, we tend to use a variety of erasers. Think again, erasers can be a great mark-making mark tool as well. Its eraser creates a different mark and should be used as necessary according to the specific drawing medium. Itong uh, eraser, uh, uh, usually ginagamit natin siya uh, upang mabura. Halimbawa, um, uh, accidentally na, na, um, na sulatan natin, naguhitan natin, na, and then uh, somehow hindi natin yung gusto, yung some angles some portions of our drawing. So, uh, subsequently, we tend to remove the spot. The area that uh, we think we see, we had a mistake on it. Okay, understood? Next, a good pencil sharpener. Pencils need to be sharpened with a quality pencil sharpener. Of course, if uh, we have a quality pencil, so, we tend to use also a quality of sharpener to use 
understood. Use a four quality sharpener and you could be out of pencil in a matter of moments. So, na experience ko na ito na um, I have a quality of pencil but the quality of sharpener is very low. So, um, the pencil uh, uh, was consumed and um, the money that I uh, uh, sp that I spent on buying it was um, uh, get worthless because the sharpener is on its low quality. Then drawing paper. This type does not move easily when pressure is applied on the paper. So hindi siya um etong drawing paper uh, hindi siya uh, agad agad na tutupe. Oslo paper is commonly used but bond paper is also recommended. Ito nagamit um di ko pa to nagagamit na Oslo paper but honestly ang um, preferably kong gamitin if there is um sketching, drawing or drafting uh, process occurred in the school I prepare to use band paper uh, whether it is long or short band paper any size masking tape uh, masking tape is used for patterning the drawing paper on the drawing table or drawing board because it does not damage the board and it will not damage the paper if it is removed by folding it off. I experience using masking tape um, most of the time um, in the school, um, especially um, if uh, I write my name on a piece of paper, then I um, I put it on my pen uh, in order for the uh, for my pen uh, hindi siya mawala parang may mark siya may tanda siya uh, hindi ko siya kapag na halimbawa na hulog pwede siyang makita na pangalan ko ngayon so parang mark siya then may maraming mga purpose siya itong masking tape din basta gusto mo siyang i-paste sa area na gusto mong um, ilagay. Yung, ano ba, yung paper or design. Yun. Then, next, triangular scales. What is triangular scale? A tool generally used when reproducing a drawing in a large or reduced for some regular proportion. So, uh, maganda na siya. You have a guide in drawing. Uh, hindi ko pa siya na-try, but um, I think all the um a uh, person who are a uh, loves of a passion in uh drafting or especially yung mga engineers so alam ito or alam tong gamitin its main function is to reproduce the measurement of an object in full size reduced size and enlarged size next skills uh, is usually used for measuring. Of course, scales are used for uh, measuring, then reducing or enlarging the measurement of a drawing. To have a perfect angle, accurate drawing, uh, we tend to use this uh, um, tool. Then this square, a drawing instrument when making hor horizontal lines. It is also used for guiding triangles when drawing vertical lines. To have a very perfect um, uh, horizontal line, we tend to use this T square. I already experienced how to use it. Uh, specifically, uh, used for guiding triangles when drawing vertical lines. Made up of wood, a plastic or combination of both. I already use um, wood and plastic. Preferably, depend upon on what uh, what you like. What could you prepare? Kung wood or plastic, okay lang. Triangles. It is three-sided ruler with a typically has two equal sides. 
meeting at 90 degree angles and to third side 45 30 including 60 degree angles commonly used triangles are 30 degrees times 60 degrees also 45 degrees times 45 degrees um depende kung ano yung paggagamitan mo na ano ang yung gagawin mo so pwede mo siyang uh, gamitin ng iba-ibang klasing triangles na ito then uh, i have here a protractor a semicircular instrument divided into 180 equal parts each of which is called degree so the whole uh, measurement uh, if you um, measure the uh, measurement the semicircular instrument of the protractor is equal to 180 equal parts. It is used to determine gradation of the degrees when measuring arcs, angles, and arcs. So, most specifically, so, mas ginagamit siya sa pag-measure ng mga arcs, angles, and circles. Then, I have listed uh, here uh, compass. This drawing instrument is used when drawing arcs and circles. It is used to a similar way to a divider. So, nagamit ko na din ito na compass uh, uh, in, especially in uh, creating a perfect circle. Uh, compass is advisable to use. It is composed of one with the pen leg and the needle point leg being held together with the handle. Next, divider. It is used when transferring measurements, dividing arcs and lines into the desired number of equal parts. It can easily transfer accurate measurements by adjusting divider points. So, divider, may pagkasimilar siya sa... Um, structure ng compass. So, parang pareho lang yung kanilang ano, um, yung image. Then, ruler. Also called as line gauge. An instrument used in geometry, technical drawing, um, printing, uh, engineering and building to measure a distance or to rule the straight lines. Commonly used, um, uh, nobody of us cannot uh, know or cannot be familiar of um, ruler. We already experienced how to use it in during our uh, elementary years, school, school days. And now that we are in the college level, then tracing paper. Ano ba tong tracing paper na ito? Tracing paper is a thin, transparent paper on which ink or pencil drawing is made for reproduction in a blue blueprint or white print. I I firstly encountered this um, kind of paper the tracing paper and I think uh, it is used in the um, 2D or 3D animation process then next drawing paper a hard and smooth surface it does not grow easily when pressure is applied to the pencil it can withstand ratios also paper is an example of good drawing paper so, itong drawing paper, so as a, um, if you are a, a sketch, if you love a sketching, drawing, or drafting, uh, we are familiar, familiarized, we are already familiar with the drawing, the best drawing paper na pwede natin gamitin para maging um, perfect, accurate, uh, yung output natin, na gusto natin palabasin. Then, adjustable triangles. Ano ba to? A device combines the protractor with the triangles to produce great versatility of use. So, ito, 
uh, mas magiging um, uh, maganda kapag ipakinabang yung resulta kapag we combine it uh, with the um, protractor. Maging versatility of juice, meaning maging uh, talagang accurate yung gusto natin um, yung measure natin um, talagang maging accurate mismo itong adjustable triangle will be partner to use with the protector understood next friends curves uh, ito naman na friends curve ay ginagamit to draw irregular curves when we um when we are drawing several irregular curves na mahirap, so uh, the friends curves is there for us to rescue. Pwede na siya siyang gamitin sa uh, pag-sketch, pag-draft, or sa drawing. Coloring materials. So, di natin... Uh, di ito nawawala sa panlasa natin yung magandang pagpili ng um, coloring material na talagang suitable doon sa um, sa taste natin sa gusto talaga natin uh, depend upon on us kung anong brand yung gusto natin consist of pigment more, more mucilage uh, gummy substance from the plants it is used to color growing simply to color to to have a colorful appearance, mas ma-enlighten, matingin yung um, uh, dark uh, spots kung gusto natin i-sharpen uh, i yung drawing natin. So, talagang um, gagamitin natin itong coloring material. Then, we have here drawing ink. Drawing ink, black, waterproof, and quick to dry ink used in drawing. So, ito yung mga drawing ink naman. Very familiar tayo dito. Iba-ibang gamit. Uh, pwede siya sa pencil pen. Basta, uh, iba-ibang gamit itong uh, mga ink na ito. So, para mas ma-enlighten, ma-highlight um, yung area, surface, na din drawing natin. So, we need to use this drawing ink para visible. Then, uh, next, technical fountain pen. With the tube and needle point is available in several line width, which are fixed and suitable for prehand and mechanical drawing and line work. So, ito pala mga ginagamit ito uh, during the mechanical drawing and line work. So, hindi ko pa siya, um, hindi pa ako personally nakakagamit nito. Sana uh, makagamit din ako nito. Then, drawing or drafting templates. So, kailangan ng mga drawing or drafting templates. So, ano ba ito? Mga flat piece of plastic with the standard symbols cut onto it. The drafting template shapes are used as guide for drawing symbols on plants. So, ito, pangalaan ng mga flat piece of plastic with the standard symbols cut onto it. Mga ginagamit pala siya, mga drafting templates na maiba-ibang shapes na magiging guide uh, uh, serve as the basis for drawing symbols on uh, plants. Um, halimbawa, mga complex na siya, uh, mga complex na mga mga subject, mga um, angles, mga complex na mga drawing or shape, so, kailangan natin dito ng mga drafting templates or drafting dra drafting or drawing templates rather. Uh, next, rolling pen. Used to ink drawn with instrument number to in freehand lettering. So, um, rolling pen used to ink drawn with instrument. So, um, ito yung ginagamit natin para um, uh, maglagay ng ink to uh, surface. Never to ink prehand lettering. So, wag natin gamitin yung kamay natin. But use rolling pen. Then, next online drawing table. A special table with an adjustable top. So that it can be 
Titled to a Desired Angle. So, drawing table, kailangan din ito para um, um, maging comfortable yung process of the sketching, drafting, or drawing process natin. Para maging um, talagang comfortable, maging accurate yung gusto natin um, output. Then, next, on the line, drawing board. What it is? Where drawing paper attached? Dito, sa drawing board, inilalagay o ina-attach itong drawing paper. Para huwag siyang gumalaw kapag uh, we already started drawing, sketching, or um, drafting. Then, that's all for today. These are the references. Uh, please uh, con uh, free to consult the following and if you have violent uh, if you have any questions violent reactions pre feel to um, um, ask me or communicate with me so that we will able to uh, answer and solve that problem subsequently that's all for today and thank you